we discovered that there were many children arriving in the Washington area as refugees. And they've just come out of a horrific situation, terrible memories, great sense of uncertainty as to where they are, what's going to happen to them. Art has the power to communicate without the use of language. And we've designed a program uh, where we look at art and we make art. And our first project, because uh, this year, because the children were coming from Burma, Bhutan, Iraq, uh, Eritrea, Sudan, the Congo. If you have many fears, what do you do traditionally to overcome them in traditional societies? We can see it in our galleries. You have amulets, things that you wear that protect you. So we had a little project and we discovered very quickly wonderful jade amulets, 3,000 years old up here at the Sackler, wonderful amulets being worn by the members of the imperial family. We were able to show that whether you were in Chinese culture or you were in African culture, uh, everyone has fears, everyone has little objects that give them strength. And then we made wonderful repose amulets in which you could put prayers. And they're putting them on and going out feeling so much.